Hello, Mr. Red here. Today is still May 26, 2016, and I'm still at the honeybee house, and now I'm working on another hive. This one also has just been in here for a few days, and you can still see I'm still working on the uh, on the one I, I got earlier this morning. It's still over there, and uh, and now I'm coming to get this one right here. So, it's God's blessings continue upon me this day, and I'm thanking Him for it. Go ahead and cut a little bit more of this uh, underneath side, the plywood out. Easy access to those bees, and I'm just going to vacuum these girls. And we'll just have it done with soon. So, here I go with uh, doing a little cutaway, and then the vacuuming. Let's get busy. <music> How about that for a nice little hive of bees? And they haven't been up here for more than a week either. You can see the comb peeking out of there. So I'm going to just start vacuuming, looking for the queen. Alright, time to start the vacuum. about that woohoo a blessing from Jesus look at that girl that was not that difficult to find her well she's in there and she's gonna be going up to the Abbey thank you Jesus for this blessing Let's finish this up. And this one is in the box, literally. It didn't take very long. I bet I wasn't here an hour. And I got most of them sucked up. And here they are inside the vacuum box right here. It's a good number of these. And then this is the only comb that I've really saved these three pieces and and look who we have right there oh yeah her royal majesty that is one big butt woman so I'm gonna put this back into the well, this frame back into the box all this is just some old brood comb that I have in here and uh, when I get up to the Abbey I'm just gonna place that on top of uh, that box right there and release the bees and let them find their queen and we'll just keep on moving ahead. Well, that's all I have for you today on this job. Um, I thank you for watching. Keep on watching and I'll be making more. God bless. Mr. Ed, I'm out of here. And stay tuned for that video tomorrow.